Tell me when I'm allowed to open. Open it up. Ah! Oh, yeah. Ah! <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah. Is that the correct size? I gotta see. Uh, how. I think it must be the correct size, yeah. I have one bigger because I'm not gonna go for smaller for you. <laughs> no, it's great. <laughs> yeah. I think it's great, yeah. Great. Should I just try it on right now? Yeah, because. Oh, going to <laughs> you don't up. have to, but because ESN is great too. But I thought Golden Era, Arnold. You know? I also got ten on uh, because uh, I was doing funny videos. Did you spray ten? Yeah. Oh. <laughs> there, uh, the convention was very funny. <laughs> Actually, I wanted to go up on stage. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> that was the plan. I think it fits perfectly. It's perfect. Yeah. Are you ready to pump up, bro? Yeah. <laughs> Me Just day. It's, it's, it's chest day. Chest day is the the old school training. Yeah. Like nothing, nothing beats it. We're going to do your plan. Yeah. Yeah. Sure. I'm excited for that. I saw uh, today because I wanted to have like a little knowledge how your chest day is going. Yeah. So uh, you, uh, you want to start right now, or would you like to tell what's the plan for today? Well, the plan of today is yeah, well, of course this is not the gym that i normally train at so it really depends on the machines yeah. and i've only trained here in the peak week so also no real workouts but normally i like to start out with of course a press um, we're keeping it safe so no blue no free weights no barbells no dumbbells for okay. now yeah. um, i did do some dumbbell flies but that's because it's super busy here and it was the only option but if you're gonna do one thing, you're gonna do the Arnold double flies, right? Yeah, yeah. That's, that's what I love, bro. That's what I love. Yeah. Let's do that. Yeah. yeah, yeah, we can do that for sure. But uh, starting out with a press, just a neutral press to get the whole chest warmed up, and then an incline press to get the upper chest you know, shelf. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. And uh, after that, uh, a fly variation. So if you can do the double fly or the cable fly, one of those, and uh, maybe then some uh, dips to finish it off. Okay. Maybe let's see if you do a machine or freeway dip even, just really as a finisher, yeah. and then uh, going straight to the side delts. That's the, the only real difference between the old school and now. The delts back then were smaller. Yeah. So because sure. they want to push out the chest and the arms and to keep the delts in, but nowadays you need like super wide delts. All the, so uh, for the classic physique, you need. Yeah, you need it. You, you know, you see Chris when he does even a front last spread, even then his delts come out. So I don't have a choice. Uh. Yeah, so uh, side delt, <laughs> side delt movement, of course. Yeah. We are going to do the old school Arnold side delt movement. <laughs> what? No, not like that, but like move? this. Like the laying oh, down. Yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah, I like that. I like that. But yeah. we're going to do it even more perfect. And okay. then, of course, some uh, triceps. Okay, so, so, we, so we got today a uh, full uh, push workout, right? Yeah, except for the except for the front delts. Okay. I never train the front delts separately myself. Never? No, because they already, for me, they already develop enough by doing chest, and um, it's it's more of a risk for injury for me personally. If I train the front delts and then the front delt becomes so overpowered that it kind of pulls your joint out of the socket yeah. compared to the rear delt. And then, you know, my rear delts are already quite strong, so it's, yeah. if I train the front delt, I have to train the rear delt even more, and it's like a chaos. Yeah, okay, <laughs> so I just leave it out, and then um, it's, it's perfectly balanced. So, what do you think? I mean, pump, pump. Let's do it. We got <laughs> little, little fingers right here. And now, for my channel. Freunde, das ist Wesley Wizzes. Er hat bei Mr. Olympia jetzt den siebten Platz erreicht. Ich habe ihn bei den Top 5 mindestens gesehen. Er sah unglaublich aus, meiner Meinung nach. War einfach unglaublich, war alles richtig geil. Ich sage, nächstes Jahr wird es auf jeden Fall mal richtig krass killen. Und ja, wir trainieren heute Brust zusammen. Wir trainieren auf seine Art und Weise. Weil ich einfach mal... Also, also wir haben mal miteinander geschrieben, so wollen wir zusammen trainieren. Ja, geil. Und jetzt haben wir uns heute getroffen und trainieren einfach Brust zusammen. Richtig geil. Bin mal gespannt, was alles... Also, wie er trainiert persönlich das zu sehen und so. Ja, und uh, your next competition is in... Six days. In six days already. Yeah. <laughs> Which show is it? Romania. Oh. Gonna do a quick qualification for next year. At least that's the goal. Yeah. And um, yeah, very excited for it already. Are you going to hit and pre-judging this yes. goal? Uh, directly, not I, that. I <laughs> saw it, because Niels recorded everything yeah. in the finals. Um, and I saw 
that that pose, the mass looks way better compared to the rest. Yeah. Because otherwise it's more of an artistic pose, a throwback to the old school, but if you want to rack your points up with the judges, you got to show the mass. You can do that when you do your uh, performance. Yeah, you know? then I will for sure. That's It's a great way because if I hit this, I can very easily go back to this and do a lot of stuff with it, yeah. or transition from a back wall bicep going to this one. and. You can do a lot of transitions with it, but it's no use in a comparison because you're going through. Because I have to do um, abs and thighs first, keep the vacuum, and then go to this one, another vacuum. It's, you know, you may not see it, but it's like... Very hard. Yeah, very hard. It's like no breath at all. And then I hope every time they call out the very classic pose, I'm like, okay, please say, say relax. <laughs> because it, you gotta, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and this one is way easier because you still have to hold a vacuum, but it's if I let out the vacuum here, it doesn't look good. I know it's so you know the stomach needs to be in. When you have this pose you can You can still breathe a little bit. A, like a little uh, transition. Yeah. You go from here at the moment to your there, breath you can release your breath and yeah, but I can even I can, I can even do over. this, for example this one and yeah. then go to this because it's the most muscular but it's a classic version. Yeah. Ramon does it, Chris does it, so even though you're not supposed to do a most muscular in the favorite classic, it's literally the pose that Arnold Schwarzenegger ended his routines with always. So it's it's one of the most classic poses you can do, uh, yeah. but uh, you don't want to disrespect the decision that they replaced the most muscular with something else. Yeah. So you at least have to do something first, showcase, okay, I have a classic pose, and then end it off with like a most muscular. That's uh, was a possibility, so. That, I, yeah. I saw in the finals. No, no, no. It's not far ahead, but I saw you then in the pre-judging. You were standing a few seconds after, also. I yeah. Think, yeah. You were standing there and just showing yourself. Yeah, that yeah. Was great. That was good. It's about those little things that can make a difference. Yeah. Because that's the last thing they see. Yeah. Because if you walk up straight away, they don't even uh, remember you. Yeah. But if you are the last one on stage, like okay, uh, leaves a memory, and then who knows? Maybe uh, one point up. Yeah, that's what I mean. Yeah. Also, yeah. And also the, those guys who are always like walking in front. Yeah. It's like, you gotta do that somehow. It's because you look at the line. Every time that I do a pose, I look down, I see, okay, there's the line and there's the other guys. So if I see them in front of the line, I gotta go with them. Because yeah. I'm supposed to be the biggest guy, but if they're one feet, two feet in front of me, I can't have them be bigger than me when it's not the That's truth. That's an out angle. Yeah, bullshit. it's literally an out angle. And actually, you need just like a glass wall in front of all those guys. <laughs> and then you're going to see or all like of Or like an invisible, invisible electric fence. It's like <laughs> 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 and then you can't... <laughs> that would be great. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> but the, the electric fence is basically Steve Weinberger because he shouts so loudly like, Oh shit, I can't... Yeah. Uh, I must listen to this guy because... If you piss him off too much, it can literally cost you a placing. Yeah. Yeah. Because bodybuilding, like especially classic physique, it's a presentation thing. So you got to present yourself as a professional, in my opinion. If you keep breaking his rule, I mean, it doesn't look good. Yeah. So uh, I remember, uh, like a few years ago, when Rian and Chris were battling it out. Yeah. And they were touching elbows, and Rian got quite angry at Chris. I think that's something like that maybe cause like the switch because Chris remains always kind, professional or like Phil Heath and Kai Green. Yeah. You know that when Kai turned like that yeah. and looked into yeah. eyes like that yeah. and Phil was like, yeah, I don't give a shit like yeah. that. <laughs> Just looking at him, what are you doing, man? Yeah. Yeah. I don't get that angry uh, ever. So. But, uh, oh, that's good. I think it's time to, uh, to get started, right? Time to get a good uh, chest pump, right? I'll yeah. take my sweatshirt on to get the For blood pump, flowing pump and cover, the you know? heat up. That's what I'm doing this with this. Oh yeah. You uh, grew quite quickly, right, on uh, social media? I started social media like three and a half years ago. Yeah. But I took it seriously like two years ago and I found my own way. So to entertain people yeah. in my funny way, you know. Yeah, because that's your, your talent, is to effortlessly be funny. Like, <laughs> that's, you automatically are funny. I need a little the left side a bit more stretch right now, just for quick. <laughs> you know what I mean, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah. Okay, yeah. Feels good? Yeah, feels very good.
Yesterday I were also training, I wanted to train shoulders. I started with shoulder pressing, free weights there. And then Leonidas came to me, asked me yeah, what I'm training. I said shoulders, he's like, I train legs. You want to join? <laughs> and I was like, yeah, let's go, bro. <laughs> that, was, that was very funny. Ain't nothing to it but to do it. Let's go, bro. Let's go. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Oh, yeah. These packs coming up, bro. Let's swell them up, bro. Let's go. Oh, yeah. Yeah, so you're not allowed to fully kill yourself, right? No, I, I feel already this is, it feels perfect, heavy enough, so I can still get a stimulus of the muscle without annihilating it, like Niheni. Yeah. Stimulate and annihilate. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So if I, now, if I now annihilate the muscle, it's gonna take more than a week, because I haven't trained heavy in like two, three weeks for yeah. the show, you know? Yeah. So it would be stupid to do it now. Yeah, that's what no I'm reason. asking, because I thought like, should I ask him now to do more reps or should I please him to do more reps for you now? Uh, so, so as I thought, no, better not. No, it's, it's usually if you do that around a show of a bodybuilder, it's like a double feeling because you want to be going, but you're like, at the same time, you don't want to take risks. So it's like, that, uh, it's smart, it's so yeah. smart. <clears throat> nice. <clears throat> Easy. <clears throat> Come on. <clears throat> Oh, yeah. Perfect. I do not like myself. <laughs> That's good, yeah. <laughs> that was good. Let's do um, three and a half plates? Yeah, let's do three and a half, yeah. There. Uh, I'm all the way from the Netherlands, yeah. small country, going to America, and then seeing the best in the world train here as well. Like also the open guys, yeah. seeing every, every single and different techniques they use. Like some people like wear hoodie, Everything covered, sweating their ass off, like uh, Nick Walker. Unfortunately, he couldn't compete, but he was very focused. Like he was training oh, yeah. here, like headphones on, hoodie on. You could see nothing. And uh, Sean Clarita as well, for example. I and mean, you can see Matt Jansen walking around as the coach. Like you see, super focused, a serious guy training here. And then you're like, okay, if this is this is this is on. You know, this is the real the real deal. And it does help. It does help. But without internal motivation. It's not gonna happen. It's, yeah, it's not gonna happen. <laughs> Very good. <laughs> yeah, good. That's good. Woo! Almost too many reps for almost, almost too much pump, bro. Yeah. <laughs> That's it. Pump the chest. Oh yeah. Arnold shelf. <laughs> yes. <laughs> wow, 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 wow. <laughs> it's funny because back in the day, yeah. People used to think that partials were like bullshit. Yeah. And now it's been proven that it's actually even better maybe than full range. So that's why you see Ronnie Coleman, Jay Cutler all doing like this. And they're like full range of motion was like holy back in the day. Yeah. And I was like, well, if you could do partials, just do them. It's even more stimulus. And you don't have to go through this range, which is then useless basically. You was able to see like Tom Platts or all these guys killing themselves completely. Yeah. You get like a whole two spotters. True, true. Only that he can do yeah. 20 more reps, but not by himself. Yeah. So it's almost partial yeah. reps. It is. They, it's like a feeling. It's difficult to put in a, in a study or a science or literature because it's like you feel when you just did this, you feel like, okay, this is what I need to really finish the set. You know, you just feel this is gonna bring more stimulus yeah. and no negative things, only more pump, more blood flow, more results. And it's like, it takes like 50 years for science to finally realize, oh wait, they were actually right. Yeah. But we feel it all along. Yeah, that's true. If you don't, um, if you don't have a good feeling for the body, 
then you will never know what yeah. is right for you. True. So that's that's where like even when Arnold back in the 70s talking about the mind muscle connection, it's not just a movement that you do. You feel okay. This is engaging the chest even more. I would like to show you something for uh, what I do, what I what I love to do for my chest. It's like you want to do flies, dumbbells, or so. Because I do always flies with the dumbbells. Yeah. And then I have a, like a special super sad thing. I, I'll just show you. You don't have to do that. You don't yeah, have to well. kill yourself. But it's like funny. You, you, you use your own body weight, nothing more. And no matter which exercise it was, I start with the lightest weight, 10 reps. One plate, 10 reps. One plate. Until I felt like, okay, now it's going to be hard. Yeah. But it did, sometimes it took like five or six sets to get to that weight. Yeah. Even though it was like a fourth movement. But it worked because it gets a lot of blood flow. But once you get to a certain level, then you gotta uh, focus on okay, how do I put the energy that I have in the most effective reps yeah. instead of spreading it out over everything? Because sure. all the warm ups, they don't do anything. It's only the f last few reps of the hardest set that stimulate the muscle. All the other stuff is to build up to that moment. Yeah. So, but you know, when, when you have passion in training and when it's fun to do and you do that stuff, Day in, day out, even if it's not perfect, you're still gonna grow, especially when you're a beginner. Yeah. I and mean, I did that for the first seven, eight years, and it worked tremendously until you know you come to a point where your strength is starting to plateau. Yeah. And then you gotta find something different to do. But that's how you automatically evolve. I'll take off my pants very soon because I'm sweating. Oh yeah. I can see the striations and everything from above here already. Nice. Usually. You carve off for two days. I do 900 grams of carbs per yeah. day. And then on the day of the show, you still eat a few of those Let's meals. Go. So it's like maybe 2,500 grams of carbs that you already ate. And then you have a cheat meal. And then the next workout, it needs to be a killer. But is, it, is, is it going to be chest? Legs, always legs. <laughs> always so you're legs. going to pop up the veins even yeah. more, right? Pop up the glutes, it's what, I need more glutes, so. Oh yeah, true, yeah, true. Yeah. So you do a whole booty workout. Yeah, hip thrust. <laughs> then you got like the monkey booty. Yeah. <laughs> uh. <laughs> yeah, perfect reps. All right. Neck crack in the middle. Yeah. Let's go. <laughs> was nerve blocking somewhere. Right. <sighs> Look at that chest. Yes. <clears throat> Those are the reps. <sighs> Come on. <coughs> yep. <laughs> the shorter the range of motion. The more partial partials. Yeah. That's, that's even the better. The shorter the range of motion, the more muscle you can build. <laughs> yeah. Always so remember you might as well that. Just stay here yeah. all the time. Let's go like that or deeper? I'm going to go deeper. Yeah. Okay, let's do one deeper. Okay. That's nice. Yeah. We were, uh, I was doing that machine on the second day where we, when we were here. It's pretty light, but it's nice to get used to the movement. Yeah. Hey man, what's up? Sit up here. Yeah. Yeah. Ha. With uh, two plates on, extra? Yeah. Two plates are good, I think. I'll just go to failure. Yeah. Good squeeze. Oh yeah. I can help if you want to. But That's fine. It's better to do yourself. Yeah. Oh yeah. Squeeze it, bro. Squeeze it. Yeah, 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 yeah. Very good, very good. Yeah. That was the perfect rep for you, I think. Yeah. On the last set, you can help a few uh, reps if you yeah? want. Yeah? Yeah. <laughs> okay. <laughs> feel, this feels good. Yeah. <laughs> Gotta see if it's like good weight for me or if it's too heavy. I'm not sure. Okay, yeah, it's good. Make the squeeze as hard as possible. Yeah. Yes. Hard as a lock. Woo. Come on. Wait a second. Nice. I just give myself five seconds and I do two more. Mile reps. Yes. Go. Oh. Coming. <laughs> the pump. Oh yeah. Let's check out the pump. Nice. Oh. Oh. 
Juicy. It's crazy, dude. Oh, yeah. Okay. Yeah, enough. Let's go. Perfect, perfect. Good. Yep. Oh. Woo. A bit wider. Oh, yeah. Ultimate stretch. Do it. Yes, easy. So actually a final set with one less plate. Okay. Ultimate pump. One plate? No, with just this. Okay. Oh yeah. Yep, 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 yep. That's good. That's good. Good. Wonderful. Yep. Oh. I didn't know you wanted to do some partials right now. <laughs> I love from you. Please go with your plan. Don't, yeah, yeah, yeah. don't get like... Oh, this feels more like... Yes, this feels more lactic acid than mechanical tension like the other one. Yeah, Because sure. now I feel like, okay, it's just getting blood in there, but it doesn't feel... Like a stress, you know? Okay, yeah. It's yeah, light okay. enough, so it's feels pretty safe. Okay. It's literally like in the moment you decide what's smart to do. And I also think about your body. I gotta get rid of a few of those cheesecake carbs still. Ah, okay, so <laughs> extra reps. One rep, one hundred calories, right? Yeah, exactly. <laughs> <laughs> oh, what a grip wider. Wide. Wide to be wide, right? Oh, yeah. Come on. Yes. The guy got no chance. <laughs> Not you and me, him. You kill him. Go now, kill him. Arnold is sure to bring. Yeah, of course, result. Arnold has to be around somewhere, right? Yeah, so, yeah. yeah. Dumbbell flies, yes or no? Nah, to be sure. For... I got to do one or two sets. Yeah, of course, yeah, you, you can okay. do it. Maybe I'll first pack deck. Yeah. And we finish the fly with double flies, yeah? And then I show you my special yeah, thing. Yeah, yeah. Let's change it up first, right? How far you want to go back? <laughs> Still here? <laughs> I'm not that flexible. You are. Lightweight, baby. Oh, yeah. Get a good pump. I think I need more stretch a bit. Wow. Ultimate. I'm very flexible. That's the <sighs> ultimate stretch. Yeah. Like the dumbbells have to touch the floor, yeah. right? <laughs> yeah. If it jiggles, it's fat. <laughs> <laughs> you know that speech? <laughs> uh, yep, do a, yep. Let's do a story picture together. Yes, go. Just take off your shirt, no one is going to say something. If they say something, what are you going to do? Yeah, what are you going look to at do? the chest. Yeah. Yeah. Look, look at the chest, yeah. right? Yeah. That's good. That weight. The strength is unmatched. Oh yeah. <laughs> I do flies with you... 40 kg actually. <laughs> <laughs> you become stronger the longer we train. <laughs> oh yeah, like it's Hulk. Unlocked. Like Hulk, guys. Potential is unlocking. <sighs> I stop my mentally potential limits <laughs> yeah. just by losing blood yeah, yeah. to get it into the chest. That's the thing why I get strong right now. Perfect. Let's go. That looks juicy. Ah. I would love to grab the bar here, or like the weight 
to help him to get a few more reps. But this guy has to go on stage, bro. Yeah, man. After the show. Stop that. Don't go on stage, please. We can pump here. We have, we have the best chest workout ever. Yeah, <laughs> no, yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> We can have it after. <laughs> Straight to the 65s. Yeah, buddy. Slow motion right here. Oh, yeah. But the grip is like different thick. You see that? The different thick, the grip here. Oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah. If it's where we're at, that's why I go up. Uh. <laughs> Interesting. <laughs> I don't know how wide you will go. I just put this bench a bit further <laughs> away. I'm not, I don't go super wide. You almost fill up the whole room with your. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks. Oh, yeah. Hey. Lightweight, come on. It's good for you. It's perfect. It's perfect for the competition. It's perfect. Yeah. Woo. That was perfect. Yeah. Crazy blood flow. Good pump and calm. Very good. What is that in kg? Thir 32 something. <laughs> That's it. That's a good stretch, man. Yeah. Oh, Those yeah. are the reps. But you need the dumbbell touch, as Arnold said. <laughs> Clang. Yep. That's good. I'll take more. More weight. Uh. <laughs> or as Liver King would say, more. You know, you know when he yeah. says that? Uh, the guy uh, who was in front there. The classic busy guy. Rion? Yeah. I don't know why, but he knew me. <laughs> That's funny. That's funny, yeah, man. They, a lot of more pros know who you are than you think. I, I, I can't imagine that. It's like, it's really crazy for me, bro. Yeah, but it's for me, too. I'm mean, like, um, when I walk in here and I see like big open pros who I've never talked to before, they, I'll, I'll say, hi, oh, Wes. I'm like, I don't know. I didn't know you even knew who I was, but. That's the right step to be. On the top. Yeah, to be in the top circle, basically. Because you stand out. Yeah, yeah. yeah it's always nice to hear like those professional guys who are veterans in the sport telling you that they're a fan of your physique. Yeah. I mean, it's uh, very motivating. It means that the old school bodybuilding, even today in the open class, is still like they grew up with it. So they recognize it, they, that's a motivation. So it's, it's nice. Yeah. Wesley, make the dumbbells touch. Hey. Yeah! <laughs> That's great. Yeah! Yeah. Now the Wayne's popping out, bro. Yeah. Oh, he threw the dumbbells touch. Let's go. Yeah, very good. <laughs> that was funny, actually. When you <laughs> made the dumbbell touch, they were like coming out some more mini veins, like these mini veins that you got. <laughs> that when you really pop, when you really extra like extra strength to get yeah, to the yeah. touch. Yeah, that's what I saw right now. Does, did that jiggle? That's the that's the proper old school side chest. <laughs> that's the proper old school side chest. <laughs> you know how to do it. Oh yeah, always since my birth. <laughs> I was coming out. Like you that. born. Like <laughs> Big boys, let's go. Yep. Mm. Yes. That's it. Come on. Let's go. That's it. Yes. Beautiful. But easy. Yeah, very good. That's it. Go down to the chest. Really down to the chest as you flex your shoulders back. No, no, no. Hit it like 
Or like this? Yeah, like this. And then you press it up. Then press oh, yeah. up together. But you go down with your body. Yeah. And then you have the tension to pull a lat oh, yeah, pull I, I, over I for the chest. You gotta come closer. Yeah. Uh, come closer to the bench, I mean. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Down. So really below, really below the chest. Yeah, like that. And now press upward together. Hold the power. Now you can pull over. And go down to the chest again. Yeah. <laughs> you know? You feel? <laughs> the pull over thing, it reminds me always of Arnold. Yeah. <laughs> oh, man. But do you know what I mean with this? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Oh, sexy. That's so sexy, bro. I love that. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Good one. Oh, yeah. Nice, nice technique. Yeah. <laughs> I'll just do one more fly set. Yeah. I'll do my chest pump. Some flies, brother. <laughs> A lot in the muscle. Let's go. <sighs> Yeah. Yep. Let's go. That's it. Come on. Oh yeah. Yes. Eighty-five pounds. Solid ass pounds. Let's go. Yeah, buddy. Okay. Yeah, buddy. <laughs> What is that your favorite pump of the whole body or what is the favorite pump of you? Yeah, you can't beat the chest pump. I mean backstage when you warm up, if I could only do one thing it would be push-ups. Because then that, that's the old, if you get a chest pump and an arm pump, yeah. that's what you, all you need as an old school bodybuilder. Yeah. One, one of the best pictures of Arnold, him just standing like this with his chest out. Yeah. Like, can't beat that. Next one is a true old school movement. We move on from the chest to the side delts. And this is gonna be an incline side delt, just like Arnold Schwarzenegger used to do. So this is an amazing one. And uh, it's on an angle. If you do a heavy weight with this, you're doing it wrong. So let's get started. There's no loss of tension anywhere. Yeah. O only if you do this, but you shouldn't go that high. But that's the improvement we make of Arnold. He, do, he did this all the way here. But we stop when the tension is low. Up here, yeah. it's the highest, and then you stop. And then it becomes difficult. So. Jetzt sieht man auf jeden Fall die Muskelfasern hin und her springen. Ich vergesse die ganze Zeit, dass ich hier noch Deutsch spreche. Wenn ich hier ganz hier Englisch spreche, ist lustig. Like you put this leg back. Yeah, so oh, you, you have space. Okay. You want the dumbbell to go as low as possible? Yeah. Like that? Yeah. Mm. Yes. Mm. Nice. And when you go up, try to squeeze this as hard as you can. Mm. Yeah, make it as difficult as possible. Nice. All the way down. Yeah, just like that. Mm. Yeah. That's it. Oh yeah. Old school. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it works. It worked. Instant pump. <laughs> and you can feel sweat in the eye <laughs> killing. <laughs> then you know you work hard. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> I'm crying. Uh, salty. Salty pump. Uh, uh. And now you know if you if you can do heavy with this, some, you're doing something wrong because if that's not possible. I'll, I'll take the 200, bro. <laughs> This was a warm up. You know, it's not nice. I feel very bad because when you train with someone who's like in the perfect condition and like the best condition his whole life, and you'll be like, yeah, where are my muscle fibers, bro? <laughs> I can't see them, man. Where are they? Yeah, no. Very good. Yes, 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 yes. Yeah. Awesome. Yeah. Yes. I, you like to do it often as an exercise? 
You do it often? Right? Yeah. I do it alternating. One time I do with regular dumbbells with two dumbbells. And then I can do twice as heavy because it's literally here there's no tension. But only here it becomes difficult. But here it's already difficult from the moment you start. It's just like... Yeah. And then you realize how well you can isolate this muscle and how weak it really is when it's isolated. Yeah. It's very... This is like eight or nine kilos. It's nothing. So... I never go above 10 with this. And with uh, side laterals, I go with 20, 22 and a half, usually yeah. 20 reps. Yeah. But this is, in my opinion, the best one to isolate the muscle without fatiguing anything else. Okay. So, especially at the end of a contest, where you really want to isolate something, this, something like this is perfect. You got to do that way. That's uh. really hard. That's what, I, that's what you want. Uh. I don't know, I think Arnold did that one actually, or in that way actually. He did, it, he did it flat. He did it on the bench press. Really? He held like the bench like this and it. Whoop. Hey man, hey. I just want to say I think you've made some incredible improvements. I, I, I saw your physique, I was really impressed, really impressed. I, wanna, I wanted to tell you before, but you know, it's, it's just amazing. Yeah, yeah, for sure. Coming from you know the, the our, our fraternity. Yeah, that yeah. Because, and <laughs> I, that's the whole point, right? Yeah. Like, when they give you the changes, yeah, the, the more weight. Yeah, it, re that's, it that's really helps. Changes. How much was you were you allowed to weigh more now? Seven pounds. Seven pounds. Seven. 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 Yeah. So it doesn't seem like that that much, but it does make a difference. A huge difference on stage in that condition. If you put pure muscle mass on, yeah. it also makes it easier, like with the weigh-ins, not have to worry about starving yourself or. You know, being faster. Well, or... See, that still was tough because, yeah? because well, I was, I was, remember, I was preparing for 212. Oh, yeah, yeah. Already. I wasn't going to do classic. I was yeah. going to do 212. Yeah. And then they gave us, so I had already put on more weight for 212. Yeah. So then it was kind of like the same to come down <laughs> because I had put on more weight. It's just amazing that you were able to put on so much weight. Like for the 212, even, like it's only a year since uh, you had to suck down so deep. Yeah, not even yeah. a full year. Yeah, not even a full year. Last year was in December. Yeah. Right? Yeah. We're in November, we're in November. Yeah. Not even a full year. True. So, um, yeah, we'll see what we'll do next year, brother. But you look great, too. Oh, thank you. Appreciate that. You look great. Classic, I... classic as fuck all the time. <laughs> Golden era as yeah, hell yeah. all the time. Yeah, one placing up compared to last oh, year. So, great. super happy about it. Yeah, it's great. We're slowly moving towards the, uh, yeah. the true final call out, you know, with you yes. guys in it. So, yes. that's, my, that's my dream, to be in that. To be able to do my, my routine. That's what I really want, you know. That's... Because you, you, yes, I am in the finals, but it's like one comparison and then, you, then you're gone. Yeah. But to be able to showcase your routine and really the different kind of poses yes. that Classic stands for. Yes. Yeah. And you're moving up, you're working, and you're young. You're yeah. Not like, you're not an old man like me. <laughs> but even then, even that's, yeah, even then with the improvements at your age, when you would not, you would never say that you are your age right now. You would say yeah, you're, the progress you've made is like a young guy, pretty much. Because I feel, I feel young. Yeah, you I'm look young as well. I feel okay. worn down or, or your physique old. looks very fresh. Oh yeah. Just get him. Yeah, easy. Yo. Oh yeah. If you want more, let me know. Very good, my son, very good. I know. <laughs> I just get some chalk. Sure. Power. In Germany. <laughs> I do it with 40 kg. It's actually a tip from William Bonek. He always says, okay, first you gotta do a couple regular ones, and then go as heavy as you can and just do this. Yeah? For the, for the tension. He's like. Yeah, and you can't argue with his cannonball. Uh, yeah. Jumps. My shoulders got better. Okay, I'm, I'm, I'm just holding my body weight actually currently for the next step. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. The thing is, uh, I started to train heavier since, you know Heiko Kalbach? Yeah. He told me like, yeah, you gotta do heavy. We, we've changed shoulder once, and since then, I got stronger, stronger, stronger. And from the videos, from my training videos, I got a feeling like, yeah, my shoulder changed a bit. Even though I just stay how I am. 
It's like the new um, hardcore tension. Yeah. My body has to get used to. Yeah. Or to recalm. Uh, recalm, yeah. Yeah, yeah. To adapt to it, yeah. I think it's, it always happens if you go in maintenance for long enough, but your strength increases. It has to go somewhere. It has to come from somewhere. The yeah. strength, extra muscle. And if your diet is on point and you keep training hard, eventually you will turn. Like it, it sounds bro science, but you have to turn some form of energy into muscle. Yeah. And you know, it's like you burn fat. But not, it doesn't literally turn to muscle, but you burn fat in the background yeah. and you feed the muscle with the food you eat. So eventually you replace part of the fat with new muscle mass sure. because otherwise you can't, not, you can't get stronger and in the same weight if you don't add muscle. Sure. So. Well, like Ronnie did run races, he did like this. Yeah, yeah like... Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you know the way. Like. Oh yeah. Oh, yeah. Okay. Yeah. Juicy. Let's go. Yeah. Got this. Oh, yeah. Yeah. You'll manage your body. It's good. Yeah, it's good. I gotta take some heavy weight. I can't, I can't do ladder races not as heavy as possible. <laughs> Since I've trained with him. If it works, it works, right? Yeah. So, what are we gonna do? <laughs> I took that fun. weight. That's like, what is that? 110? Yeah, 55. Oh, the 55. What is that, that is in kg? And what is that in kilograms? 25, uh, 24, 25 kilos. Okay. I try first with them. Yeah. That's above 30. If you can 25. lift it, it's lightweight, baby. Look at that. <sighs> nice. I need more weight. Wow. <laughs> it's, yeah. As I mentioned, you get stronger the longer the workout takes. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> well, I'm ready for, uh, for triceps. All right, okay, I'll, I'll just do one more. Sure. Completely yeah. fucked up. Annihilate the side out. Annihilate. Rip off the side delts. <laughs> Let's fuck it up. <laughs> like that. And just to be sure that it's... Then you have like 42. Yeah. Two kilos is nothing, so might as well. I, I just might take 95, right? <laughs> yeah, yeah, then you're, then you're very sure. <laughs> but then you might as well go for 100, you know? And you got a bigger number. <laughs> uh, <laughs> I got to make Heiko Kalbach proud. Right? Yeah, yeah. But it's like, but the grip is different. I really have to take 95. <laughs> God has given a sign. Yeah. <coughs> Look at that. <coughs> oh, my quick straight. Whoa. Come on. <coughs> yeah. <coughs> That's it. <sighs> nice. <coughs> Hip. Hip. So Perfect. that's why you need chalk. <laughs> yeah. And because now of I my understand. finger. Now we, oh yeah. And now it's uh, logical. <laughs> yeah. I think, or you can lean backward. Just like, because it, it twists itself, right? Yeah. Yeah, I like that. Yeah. yeah. <sighs> oh yeah. If you want to twist, it's so hard though. Yeah. That. Yeah, but he turns his whole body. Yeah, he does. Yeah. Uh, yeah. That. That. Yeah. Like, you, is no that No one thing? can do that in a classic physique division right now. So that's what I'm going to do in my routine. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Just do that the whole time. And then <laughs> <laughs> Just like, ha, yeah. ha, post time. <laughs> post, post time. Yeah. Ha, 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 ha. Yeah. Feels good? Yeah. Only hard to get it out, maybe. Can you help with? Yeah. Because I'm not flexible at all in this position. Yeah. <laughs> Why? I don't know. <laughs> Got all it? Right. Yeah. 
Oh, it feels good. Yeah. That's <laughs> Yeah, it's still, still pretty light. Have you? You can take more. Yep. All right. Yep. Yep. Got it? Yep. Okay. <laughs> Heavy now? Now it's good. Oh, yeah. Hell yeah. Oh. Pump it. Oh, yeah. 20 more reps. Oh yeah. Awesome. And up. Uh, yeah, that's great. If you need a spot, let me know, bro. Okay. Okay. So now it's heavy. How many wow. more plates you did now? Two, two more. You did 80 first, and now I put it at 100. Okay. Let's do it. <laughs> Ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen. Oh yeah, two more, all right? Let's go. All right, easy. And great. Yeah. Come on. This is it. The final tricep set in the Orlando. Oh yeah. In the Mr. Olympia environment. Let's go. One more. Yeah. Yep, got it. Ah uh. oh, yeah. Like out of there, right? <laughs> you know that, right? Yeah. And then he was looking yeah. like this. And then, <laughs> yeah. with the dumbbell, right? Yeah. <laughs> Could be a good reel. <laughs> Walk through the whole gym like this. <laughs> you, POV, you need the blood flow. Yeah. <laughs> Get the lactic acid out. <laughs> you, need the, you need your veins. <laughs> Great workout, man. Yeah, it was really good, it was really good. <sighs> Happy we did it. Now nice. you gotta take off your shirt and be dominant. <laughs> right? You just gotta do like that, it. and you walk around. If you don't have it, don't hit it. Yeah. <laughs> no, Frank. When I say side chest, you gotta do the side chest. Yeah, not the front. <laughs> not the front chest. And if you don't have it, don't, don't hit it. it. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, like that. <laughs> just don't hit it. Yeah. yeah. <laughs>